What's up YouTube, Brackix back again. Just wanted to do a Kobe 8 and 9 low comparison video. And uh, let's get right into it. As far as the upper goes aesthetically, you can see that there's a dynamic flower system in play. And it definitely adds a little more pop and a little more color to the side compared to the Kobe 8 right there. As far as the engineered mesh goes, this is a little softer than the Kobe 8. But uh, for the Kobe 8, as you wear it more and more, the engineered mesh will, does soften up, so it does have the same feel. As you can see from the side, you got these two TPU plates right here for support laterally, as well as the medial side right here. Compared to the Kobe 8, you have just one heel clip, and I've heard stories where uh, some people's clips would break. But uh, this is TPU after all, even carbon fiber would break. On the bottom of the shoe you see this pressure mapping of a foot compared to storytelling traction. Another key thing that's really different is there is no torsional support plate right there. As for this one there is a carbon fiber plate right there. As far as height goes this is extremely similar. Uh, I think this the heel right here is just a little higher. Another key thing right here is the tongue. As you can see right here, this is a really flimsy tongue, really thin. And you got a really nice padded tongue right here. Another key difference between the two shoes are the inserts themselves. The red one is the Kobe 9 insert with the scale-like patterns. Prevents your foot from slipping forward or backward during movement. And uh, the lunar line on this pair right here is a lot more firm than the Kobe 8 insole. Personally, I feel like the designers really just made the Kobe 9 low, uh, Kobe 8.5, because it's a similar cushioning system, still has beastly traction, uh, they just added some flower wire, and uh, similar to the Kobe 8 Elite model, they just added some things here and there with a super padded tongue which uh, definitely makes the fit a lot well, more that's secure. That's pretty much the end of my video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you to everyone that's been supporting me and leaving me comments and liking my videos. And uh, until next time, guys, I'll catch you later. Hey, what's up, guys? Just wanted to say uh, thanks to everybody who left a comment on my Nike ID video. I couldn't decide what to get, but uh, I ended up ordering two pairs, and uh, hopefully I'll get to review them in a month and a half. Thanks, guys. Peace.